always tracking, always alerting. This is Storm Team 8. All right, let's start off with temperatures across the board. Right now we're sitting in the 20s. We're going to be falling close to 20 tonight. So it's going to be a cool night, pretty standard for this time of year. Technically just a little chillier than average. Here's what we're expecting for the next three days. A big warming trend starts and then it really gets going next week. So next week is going to be even warmer than this weekend. And this weekend we're going to be in the 40s. So here are the next three days for us. Tomorrow, 36 degrees. We are expecting a light wintry mix to develop, mostly snow more than anything, but that should be especially in the afternoon. As for Friday, we expect rain showers to develop, especially late, and highs will be close to 42, so it'll be a cold rain. The wind really builds in for Saturday, and even though Saturday's high will be up near 46 degrees, we expect crashing temperatures as the wind builds in and a transition from rain to snow. So Saturday is going to be kind of one of those wild days where you see that big temperature drop in the afternoon. Here's what's going on right now in Storm Track Live. It's quiet. You can see we have a system to the north of us, but we just have a few clouds rolling on through. So the next 12 hours here are going to be pretty easy to take. Again, temps right now are already sinking into the 20s, if not the teens, and our wind is settling down. But tomorrow, we are going to have the wind pick back up, which means wind chills will likely still be in the 20s. Here's your future cast. This is as we get into Thursday. Starting off the day, and especially towards noon, we should see a wintry mix develop and then a little bit of light snow. Not expecting much in the way of accumulation, but if you have somewhere to be in the middle of the day, keep in mind you might be running into some snow chances. That moves through just as easily as it came. And then into Friday we go, we'll see first one warm sector and then a second. And for Friday, as the temperatures warm up into the 40s, we will see rain develop late. Notice the farther north you go, the better chance of just straight snow but most of West Michigan, Big Rapids down to the south, it's rain that we're talking about for Friday. So snow accumulations are going to be accentuated further to the north, Houghton Lake, and further. And your eight-day forecast shows that we go from 46 in a windy, rainy, snowy mix on Saturday to 44 on Sunday with sunshine. So Sunday is going to be pretty pleasant and still warmer than average. We hold on to that warmer than average trend. It gets a big push of even more warm air, so much so that by next Thursday, we could be talking about temperatures in the upper 50s, if not 60 degrees. So a lot to talk about weather-wise. Matt Kirkwood will be out at Bittersweet tomorrow, the only skiable day, basically, <laughs> in the eight-day forecast. <laughs> uh, take advantage of it. Yeah. Right. Thanks, Ellen.